back here with another video and I'm going to be doing a shelter building and a camp out with Molly. So it should be good. Uh, enjoy the video. So first up I'm just going to be clearing out the bush where I'm going to be camping. I found a nice spot between two trees where I can put up a ridge pole and have logs going back and make a sort of shelter. And then I, I want to put a the reflector was in front of behind my fire so then I could get heat back into the So what I've done is made a ridge line for my uh, of a piece of dead uh, wattle and then what I'm gonna do is cut some slats and just put them going down that way and then I've got like a plastic top that I'm going to put over and then get this get to it. and this because it's dead it will do great with firewood as well so that's very nice I'm going to get a few uh, slats to go down the back and then catch you guys in a bit. So I was just having a quick uh, water break. So I've pretty much done all the slats going down the back. And then I've got this bin bag sort of top thing that I've stuck together. And it's quite thick top and it's water like thick plastic and it's waterproof. And I was just having a quick bite a snacker bar and some water and then probably get back to work and do some side slats on the side over there on the other side and then some brush at the back and I'll probably do the uh, fire reflector to get some heat back into the shelter. So there's starts, I might have to cut a few more logs just to add a bit of height. Then I'll make them fly in front. Should be good. Clean away 
get rid of the brush and I finished up the reflector wall. Started to get a little bit of paracord and then probably just chill for a bit. And then I did finish the shelter. All I need to do is wrap the ends up a bit. And then pretty much done. Yeah, not much else to do, so should be good. And then we'll just chill a bit. So what I've got here is just some uh, dry wood from home and I soaked some cotton pads in metal laces spirits as a fire starter. So I'll just grab one of these pads, just place it where I want to make my fire, grab some of these little twigs and stuff, light this guy. Not a very visible flame but I know it's there. And then I've just created three bundles of sticks and I'm just going to place them around. on top and you want to get as much airflow inside there as possible and then just let them catch a light So I've just got my I've just got my little grid with a little stand that I made, pot holder, and then uh, put on my seasoned steak. So I've just put on my seasoned steak, and then I'm just gonna put my mealy on next to it. Just let it cook in the coals there, and then let my steak cook. Looks like it's going quite well. And then put a bit more coals around the milli. And then let that cook a bit and I'll catch you guys a bit later. So I just finished cooking supper. Got the milli nice, nice and roasted. And I cooked the steak medium rare. Or just over that which is perfect and it's very well seasoned and it's delicious. So I will catch you guys in the morning and Thanks so much for watching, hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you next time.